We are digging into our own history here at Channel 8. Our station was once owned by the eccentric billionaire Howard Hughes. And there's a building in our parking lot that we affectionately call the Hughes House, where he actually stayed back in the 1950s. Christian is live out there in our backyard right now to tell us more about it. Christian? Well, Denise, this green bungalow, believe it or not, was a was basically part of a hotel. We call it here at Asia, we call it the Hughes House, and it's sometimes it's called the greenhouse as well. Let me give you a quick tour here inside. Now, there's bathrooms here. There's also a kitchen, and there's also a, a dining room area, basically with a huge, huge, huge table. Now, it stood in this spot since the 50s. Hughes fell in love with Las Vegas and leased it during that decade. At this time, it was adjacent to the desert in hotel and stood on the grounds of what was called the Sun Villa Motel and later the Blair House Motel. Neither of those are here anymore, of course, but this house is still standing tall. The bungalow even made it to the big screen, appearing in the classic Las Vegas mobster flick, Casino, that tells the story of the Las Vegas mobsters Lefty Rosenthal and Tony Spilatro, which is played by Robert De Niro and Joe Pesci. In the movie, it was used as the home of the character portrayed by James Woods. It is seen when Sharon Stone's character runs off to L.A. with him. Hughes was a well-known movie lover and movie maker himself. Inside, there are classic Hughes items like old rotary phones and some classic aviation photos of Hughes on the wall now. Well, back out here live with this live picture, Hughes bought Channel 8 in the 70s after he was staying at this bungalow. You can check out here some of these pretty cool pieces. Now, there is a ton of interesting history in here and associated with Hughes. So over the next month, we want to share a little bit of that history, of course, with all of our viewers. Denise, I'll send it back over to you. What Christian didn't mention is many people think that house is haunted. Yes. <laughs>